hello guys if it is your first time being on the channel i'm going to be sharing five rules that you need to know when you want to make money on spot betting five rules that you need to know when you want to make money on spot betting so make sure you stay with me from beginning till the end so that you will be able to make money on spot betting or being able to use these rules well so that you can use it to make money on spot betting so make sure you stay with me from beginning to the end and by the way if you are interested in knowing all these strategies so make sure you subscribe to the channel just touch the red button it will just take only three seconds to do that touch the like button and you can also share this video to friends because they will benefit a lot from that so you can also share it to friends so actually i'm not going to drain much of your time i'll just go straight to the the points and i'll explain each point i will be explaining it into detail detail like i will explain it in depth for you guys so make sure you stay with me let's drop in so the first gate or the first rule that you need to know why you want to make money on spot betting is strategy you need to be having a good strategy what did i mean by strategy a strategy like are you bet on multiple bets or you are bet on single games that is a strategy let's say even if you are bet on single games what kind of games are you betting on are you betting on first half or are you bet on second half or you're combining full time you should know that you should have that strategy you should have that in mind so why not i know that okay i'm using this strategy every better need to have a strategy let's say you you are having a strategy like that you are the type that you use a strategy of single games you are betting on single games let's say you are betting on single games or let me use it that you are betting on single games make sure that you normally bet on single games always or consistently yeah you use one month or two months to bet on single games to see how your profit will run use another like month use another month to bet on maybe multiples multiples to see how your odd or your profit will go use another way like just do it to bet on halves first half to see how your profit will run when you try all these strategies you end up getting a good strategy that will work for you all time so that when you now use that strategy you are going to be making money on spot betting so make sure you use this number one strategy or use this number one rule which is strategy strategy betting so number two is good analysis so as a better you need to have a good analysis what did i mean by that a good analysis is like you need to be able to analyze a game to see what is going to be the score line or what is going to be the results so when you know that when you know that okay this is going to be the results let's say you have analyzed everything and you know that two games two games is going to like or let's say this game is going to end on a draw or this game is going to end on let's say one one or two two or three three that's has draw so this one will motivate you to, or will give you the chance of predicting on handicap you can now let's say you do your analysis and you end up seeing that the game is going to be on a draw and one game is one team is having higher odds you now move to that team the team that is having higher odds and now bet on that team on handicap so that you can let's say you now see that they'll be a playing on a draw and a particular team is having four cd odds and another one is having one cd maybe 50 cd sorry one cd 50 pesos odd so you can now move to the one cd 40 like the four cd team to bet on that team on handicap you cannot bet on handicap too when you not bet on handicap too on that team actually you see that they also be somehow high so that you can be able to place on single game and make profit out of it so when you are able to have good analysis or you have analyzed and you just get to know that you are having believe they can believe that oh this game like this team is going to win on that so you'll be you see that that why you are now placing that kind of game 
you'll be having hope that oh the win is actually about 90 percent that one you'll not panic even when they are after 70th minute or so you'll not panic because you know that oh this game the the chance of the team that you have selected winning is very high you not have that kind of panicking that oh i'm going to lose my money or so so make sure you have good analysis so that you can be able to you can be able to make money on sport betting so the third thing that i'll talk about is patience and calm you need to be patient and calm when you come to sport betting what did i mean by patient and calm on sport betting i know many people will be asking questions in the comment section what do you mean by patience and calm what i mean by patient and calm is that let's say you have do your analysis and you like you see that oh this particular a particular team is going to be winning a particular team is going to be winning and you have placed the team and they they play around 70th minute your team still still your team have not score or they are still playing draw so you you know i'm saying okay this time like they they will end up even playing draw so this will like you see that the bookmakers or this the companies or the sport betting companies or the betting companies when you now go they will offer you a like a cash out offer they will offer you a cash out but reducing that actual amount that you have placed the actual amount that you have placed on your bed they will now reduce it to a like just reduce it to something small that when you even withdraw it you still run in loss and when you are the type that doesn't have patient and calm and coming to the point you didn't even do good analysis you end up withdrawing your money and your after the withdrawal at the end of 90th minute your team will end up winning and you have already to withdraw your money and you have lost that's the case so make sure you be you need to be calm and patient when you come to sport betting don't hesitate don't just say okay this one I will end up losing so I need to withdraw the actual amount that they do that's why you see that you go to the the your betting account when you place a bet and they don't play to some stage you see that they'll be offering you cash out they will off, be offering you cash out so they just want you to withdraw so that they will not run into like you know like get their money more that's the time let's say you 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 place a bet of a multiple bet of 10 and let's say nine nine just like nine have played nine have played and it's now level with one game you see that the the like, the bookmakers they will now give you a withdrawal and they see if the especially if the time that they like they see that your team is having upper chance of winning they will give you like the, the, the i don't know cash out they'll give you cash out to some stage i don't know like they will just give you maybe half of the, that your money so when you are the time who is not calm and not having patience you you just withdraw that may be i may end up losing all this money you just withdraw and at the end your team have won and you have already withdrawn you not get all the money that you have placed like you not get all the total amount that you were supposed to win so you need to be calm just be calm actually sport betting is actually like it's, it's gambling or we all know it's gambling but when you gamble well you're going to be making money when you gamble very well you're going to be making money on sport betting they normally say nobody knows when or nobody knows sport betting or nobody can predict yeah nobody can predict bets you can make money out of it when you are having good strategy when you're having good strategy you're going to make money on sport betting it's a light for somebody to say that oh nobody can predict the outcome you can predict the outcome yourself you can predict it only if you have good strategy and you're having patience and that of work you are having good analysis and more to the point this four four under you need to know the fourth thing that you need to know is know when to leave you should know when to leave guys you should know when to leave what did i mean by know when to leave let's say you place one day you place about three best slips you place about three best slips and you have you end up losing i'll say that that day is not a good day for you so you need to leave rest let this all the stress and anxieties let everything go 
allow that day to go don't place bet again because when you are play you want to place you'll be forcing to like to place in such a way that you'll be able to recover your money which may like let you end up losing again lose which may let you end up losing more money again so make sure like a time you should know when to leave like when you place like you place let's say you play first you do your analysis you place first game you lose you place your second game the same day you lose you place your third game the same day you lose guys i would advise you just leave it that day don't place bet again just leave it don't place bet again just leave it that way rest for the whole day or when you are having other activities just do it and leave betting for that day because when you end up like saying that you want to place bet again because you'll be forced to place more like when you were you went like you were just no like normal and you maybe you were to place maybe you would have placed only one game or two games but because you have lost money you'll be placing about three or four games or you'll be looking for high big odds to place on so that you can make money to recover your loss which may end up making you loss you may end up losing so you may end up losing that's the case so why you lose about three times on a day so make sure rest don't bet again don't bet again just rest and wait for the next day so that you can place on so by the way if you are enjoying this video to this part make sure you subscribe to the channel subscribe to the channel and like the video because i'll be sharing a big strategy or big way down of making money from beginning of a season of betting to the end of a season so make sure you subscribe to the channel subscribe to the channel so that you'll be able to get this strategy to make money on spot betting so make sure you subscribe to the channel guys i'm serious about this make sure you subscribe to the channel we are going to be making money on this channel we are going to be making money so if you are ready to make money on spot betting make sure you smash the subscribe button just smash the red button subscribe it and turn it gray turn the red button gray touch it and that's all and don't forget to also turn on the notification bell because we are ready to make money on spot betting at this point you need to be having good analysis that's the main thing guys as i say i'll be sharing a particular way of making money on spot betting when a season begins till the, the time that a season ends you're going to make more money than losses on it so that video will be uploading soon after this video maybe i'll be uploading that video after this video so make sure you subscribe to the channel to get it so the last the last tips that i'll be giving you is motivation the last tips is motivation motivation you need to motivate yourself at the time that you are low let's say you have lost consistently let's say about three times you just end up losing first second third one two three just end up losing three best sleep on a row you need to motivate yourself that oh i'm going to make money on that i'm going to recover all these losses so just motivate yourself that oh i'm going to recover all the money just put in mind that oh i'm going to recover you my money motivate yourself oh don't feel that anytime that you lose feel it as a lesson you have learned a lesson from betting just feel it as you have learned a lot or you have learned from betting just make sure that oh it's a lesson that you have learned you can use that one to reference so that next time when you are to bet you can use that loss to reference that oh last i do this way and i end up I, and i end i end up losing so this time around i need to do this way so that even if i may end up losing i'll still have some return i'll still have a return on that so make sure you do that and bonus tips bonus tip before this video end this one is just bonus actually it's a bonus one budget you need to be ha you need to have budget you need to have budget when it comes to sport betting, you need to have budget. Budget. Just budget. Know that, okay, every day I need to spend this amount on sport betting. Budget it. Let's say, okay, every day I need to spend about $10, $15. Or even, let's say, you say you are even to spend about $20 or $5 on sport betting. $5 or 5 CDs or 10 CDs or 20 CDs or 50 CDs on sport betting. 
make sure that every day when you say you want to spend this amount on that make sure that you use that day you you bet on that amount don't go beyond that don't say that okay today there's so many games that i see that i'm going to be making money on that i need to increase my budget no guys if you do that way you're going to run in losses you're going to run in losses especially when you have bad day the day that you'll be having bad day you're going to run in losses so make sure you have good strategy good strategy and that of budgeting budgeting is the key it's a bonus thing but it's a key when you budget and you say okay i'm going to spend five dollars on spot betting even when you place about your three games and you win and you have already spent your five dollars or ten dollars or depending on your budget you have already spent that just leave it you have already at the end you are already in profit you are already when you win or let's say you win you win the over the day and you have already spent your all your budget don't be go beyond that because you have you are already in profit leave it rest so that you can recover all day you can regain energy to do more analysis and make money and place the next games so guys just a recap just a recap but before i do that recap make sure you subscribe to the channel before i do that recap make sure you subscribe to the channel turn on the notification bell and don't also forget to like the video and share the video to friends i know this going video is going to be the best video when it comes to spot betting it, it's going to be the best video so make sure you subscribe to the channel so a recap about the five rules that you need to know when it comes to spot betting number one rule is strategy number one rule strategy number two is good analysis number two is good analysis number three is patient and calm you need to be patient and calm you need to be patient and calm number four is you need to know when to leave know when to leave and number five is motivation motivate yourself to come back to get all the energy even when you end up losing motivate yourself to regain all the energy and start to bet again make money so the last bonus tip is budgeting you need to have budget you need to have budget when it come to sport betting you need to have budget that's it so guys what do you want more than this what do you want more than this to make money on sport betting so make sure you smash the subscribe button if you enjoyed this video from beginning to this part smash the subscribe button smash the like button and share this video to friends so guys i think i'm done for now the only thing that i'll say is this thank you for watching and to help the channel to grow so that it can reach other people to also benefit on this type of content make sure you smash the subscribe button and smash the share button and share it to friends just share this video to friends so that they can also benefit from it as i said earlier i'll be uploading a strategy that you can use to make money when the season begins till the season end that will be like next season like next season coming you got when you use the, like that video you watch this video that video from beginning to the end you're going to be making money you're going to be in a big profit depending on the way you use that strategy you're going to be making money on spot betting or any betting way betting so make sure you subscribe to the channel and be waiting for that video so after this video i'll try my possible best best to upload that video so make sure you subscribe so guys thank you for watching and that's all for now and i'll see you in the next one bye bye